2022 saw the release of not only X, but also Pearl, a prequel to the events of that film. Both films were directed by Ty West and starred Mia Goth. In X, Mia Goth plays a dual role of Maxine Minx and Pearl. And then in Pearl, the prequel film directly after production wrapped on X, we got to explore the backstory of Pearl in her youth. Then, last summer, it was announced that a third film in the series would be made, picking up where we left off with Mia Goth's other character from X, Maxine Minx. Entitled Maxine, stylized with three X's, the film officially entered production on April 12th and just recently wrapped on May 28th, 2023. Between then and now, a few details have managed to slip through the cracks of this tight-lipped production, so let's dive right in. Make sure you give this video a like and subscribe for more up-to-date horror content, but anyway, on with the news. Spoiler alert for X, if you haven't seen that movie, or if you don't know who the character of Maxine is, you might want to check out that film and Pearl before learning about this one. As I said, the film follows Maxine Minx after the events of the first film, where she was the sole survivor of what can only be described as a massacre that took place in X. Maxine will take us to the 80s, the third decade of this film series, and will tackle Maxine's journey making a name for herself in Los Angeles amid an evolving adult film industry. A24, the film's distributor, has not revealed the film's release date just yet, but I'm imagining a spring 2024 release date to emulate the release strategy of the first film, which went on to gross $15 million against its budget of around $1 million. Pearl had a similar budget and a slightly less impressive box office return, but no details have been announced about the budget of Maxine just yet. What we do know a lot about when it comes to Maxine is its cast. Aside from Mia Goth reprising Maxine Minx, the film also stars Elizabeth Debicki, who you may know from Guardians of the Galaxy, The Crown, or I recognize her from The Cloverfield Paradox. She is rumored to be playing a film director in Maxine. Moses Sumney is also a part of the ensemble. Moses is a musician who has recently gotten into acting with roles in both Maxine and the soon-to-be-released HBO show The Idol. Michelle Monaghan, who recently had a role in last year's horror film Nanny on Amazon Prime, is also entering the extraordinary world of X in Maxine. Bobby Cannavale, who I know from The Watcher and Nine Perfect Strangers, but you may also know him from Ant-Man or Boardwalk Empire, among many other credits, is also a member of Maxine's ensemble cast. Both Bobby and Michelle are rumored to be playing LAPD detectives. Lily Collins of Emily in Paris fame will also appear in the film alongside musician Halsey, who has been breaking into acting in recent years. A still image from the film has been released of Halsey performing a scene alongside Mia Goth herself. And not only is this the first look at Halsey's character, but it's also our first look at Maxine in this new decade. Joining the aforementioned ensemble is Giancarlo Esposito from Breaking Bad and The Mandalorian. Giancarlo is rumored to be playing an adult film agent, perhaps in business directly with Maxine. And last but not least, Kevin Bacon of Footloose fame is a part of this cast as well. It's far from Kevin's first foray into horror though, having roles in classic horror films like Tremors and Flatliners. Kevin is rumored to be playing a private investigator in Maxine. The Los Angeles-based production of Maxine has been pretty tight-lipped, and the only official material released by A24 thus far has been that end credits teaser back from Pearl, and that still image of Mia Goth and Halsey. The film is written and directed by Ty West, just like X and Pearl, although Pearl was also co-written by Mia Goth. Maxine is produced by West, Mia Goth, Jacob Jaffke, Kevin Turin, and Harrison Kreese. And there you have it. It's not much, but that's everything we know about the upcoming third entry to the X film series, Maxine. I'd love to keep updating y'all on news regarding this film as it comes out, because as you know, X and Pearl were some of my favorite horror films of the last year, and dare I say of all time. So let me know in the comments if you're looking forward to Maxine, and I can keep that content coming. But also let me know your theories as to what could be going down in this film, because plot details have been very scarce. In the meantime, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time.